doesn't seem loud enough of a response for a, the crowd. Let's go. Fucking loaded. No I'd like to bring someone to the stage. The only female in the show tonight. The first person to ever sing a song at an F bomb. Ever. Everybody, please give it up. For Sid. Let me die. So, let's just fucking kill it. Yeah!
feeling? You having a good time? Oh, fuck yeah. Yeah. Let's give it up for some fucking Motorhead and some Lower East Side Love, some rock and roll. Look at all the rock and rollers. Hell yeah, thank you guys so much for coming out on short notice as well. Alright, we're gonna change up one more drummer. Let's see if we're the rock, everybody! We're also gonna figure out what happened with the lights. They're on! But as I said earlier, no. Fernando! That's the line. I'll do my best. This is what I can do. Focus, focus. Uh, everybody, Fernando Rosario, our bass player, who wants to tell you a little Motorhead story? It's actually two stories, but I'm just going to kind of mash it together. That's all right! I was at that night, and we played, and uh, he came up to me, and I was like, what the fuck, you're here? And he goes, yeah, that was the fastest bomb I ever heard. <laughs> and I was like, holy fuck, you saw us play? Holy fuck, man. And then, you know, I also used to work at the scrap bar, and Raph used to work at the scrap bar, and Raph used to be the cycle slut from hell. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Raphael, cycle slut from hell. Woo! So anyway, they opened for Motorhead. And Pete, he's also in the, he wrote all the cycle slut songs. Anyway, these guys went on into Europe and opened for Motorhead and like a fucking dick. I quit the band. I was in the cycle sluts before they went on tour. So, fuck me, I'm an asshole. I could have hung out with Lemmy, what a dick. <laughs> but, I tell you what, he also used to come to the scrapper all the time and I used to play pinball with him all the time. I, I know, I fucked up royally and I'm still kicking myself for it. Yeah. I'm a dick. I fucked up. I really fucked up. You know, and let me, let me used to come to Scrapper all the time. I used to work there. And there's one particular stretch of time. He came every Monday night. And he was the only fucking guy in the Scrapper. And me and Kate were working. And he'd fucking get two rolls of quarters, get 15 fucking double jacket and coats and pint glasses, and play pinball and drink and tell stories. And was the nicest motherfucker on the fucking planet. Let me tell you right now, he is the truest, purest rock icon, rock and roll fucking maniac that ever will be. Ever. Ever. Let's hear it for Fernando, everybody! Fuck yeah, man. Yo, give it up for Howard. He's the sound man in this bar, at this club. He makes all of us bands sound fucking amazing. And he's going to sing a song for you right now. I need the lyrics because I don't know it well enough. Sorry, Ann Daniel. This this song like encapsulates the whole Lemmy fucking thing. It's like it's like his entire philosophy distilled to there's, there's like 40 words in the whole song. It's fucking perfect. It's like a it's like a haiku but with a lot more words. <laughs> or syllables or whatever. <laughs> Rock and roll! And it's not about cleanliness. Because it doesn't matter how physically clean Lemmy was. It's about staying true to yourself. And who the fuck did it better than Lemmy? Nobody! If you're unpleased with this show, you can ask for your money back.
Lemmy. Mike Sauce, ladies and gentlemen. Let's give him power to everybody! God damn. Give it up for yourself for rocking so fucking hard and having yeah. sense enough to love Motorhead! Yeah. You guys have been loud and awesome all night. We really thank you guys so much. We pulled this together on really short notice. And we really had an awesome response from not only all the band members who jumped on us right away, but all you guys really blowing the shit up. We thank you guys so much once again. It's also my pleasure to introduce, he was behind the drums a little earlier. Here he is. Hey, what's up, Pete? Check it out, man. He was behind the drums a little earlier. He plays in the band Space Beer.